Andy Johnson, Minnesota State University. We are looking at word identification, context clues, developing the semantic cueing systems. Using context clues is one of six ways to identify words that you do not recognize as you are reading. We need to teach this. We develop the ability to use context automatically. We teach the process to develop the clues. We ask students, what word makes sense in the sentence? We do this in large group many times. We do it in small group and then individually. Eventually, students are able to do this automatically. Two simple activities to develop this ability to use context clues automatically are close and maze. Close, simply a sentence with one word missing. With younger students, we provide beginning letter clues. This takes anywhere between three and six minutes a day, quickly, quickly, quickly. The goal is to develop automaticity. The second one is maze, and it is a paragraph or sentence paragraph, series of sentence with two or three words, depending on the level. Students have to read the sentence and find the word that makes sense in the sentence. The ability to use context. We're developing this ability. We teach the process to develop the skills. Keep it simple, three to eight minutes a day. You can also use maze and close as pre-reading activities related to the story or post-reading activities. Creativity and intelligence. Use your teacher creativity and intelligence. Also, within a typical instructional session or intervention session, you see how this falls. Five to eight minutes, language experience, scaffolded writing, word work, word building. Here's your close, two to three minutes. Fluency, scaffolded reading, comprehension, and a game. This is anywhere, this is for a 30 to 50 minute session. You see where this falls. One strategy by itself does little, but all of them together, a holistic approach, a comprehensive approach to reading instruction.